Thanks to vacations, busy summer schedules, or lack thereof, blood donations are down. We need about 600 units, of, uh, 600 donations a week to meet the, the, the need. And right now, we're for the last few weeks, we've been drawing about 500. That's bad news, especially during summertime, when the need for blood actually goes up. Due to accidents and other issues that require blood transfusion. But it wasn't an accident that brought the importance of donating blood to the forefront of Levi Niebush's mind. It was his daughter. Madison was diagnosed with an extremely for, uh, rare form of cancer back in uh, 2010. Madison received countless blood transfusions after chemotherapy treatments and even during her five surgeries. Something her father said not only gave her energy, it gave her life. She just didn't want to get up, she didn't want to move, she didn't really want to eat. But when she would get a blood transfusion, she was a completely different person. She'd come in the door dancing around, uh, she was wanted to go out with her friends, and it gave her the strength to continue fighting. Madison lost her fight with cancer in January, but Levi says he'll continue to donate blood. It really was because of the importance that I learned through her and the importance uh, of, of how she reacted to it, how energetic and vital it was to her. To help others who are still fighting. There is no substitute for human blood. It can only be donated by healthy volunteer blood donors. It's the most important thing we can do. Emily Griffin, Pro News 7.